Hi Cancers, welcome back to my channel. This is Rose Carol. We're getting right into your March monthly love reading Cancers. You just saw the chariot, your energy was trying to come out in that justice card. Libra, there could be a Libra if you're dealing with one that has some unspoken um, words that they need to tell you. We have Pisces energy. There you are, chariot in reverse, Cancers. With the Queen of Pentacles, the Two of Wands in reverse. All right, over our energy for you, Cancers, is the Seven of Cups. So there's a choice that's going to be made this month, Cancers. The Seven of Cups in reverse. Just be mindful that this love relationship that you're choosing doesn't affect your independence and your stability because you're um, you're growing this month financially. You know, Nine of Pentacles in reverse to the Queen of Pentacles. Don't let anybody come between you and your money. That's just a sign for some of you here a lot of you are going to be meeting your true love this month it's going to lead to a beautiful firm stable long-term commitment here your new person could be a gemini so whatever choice you make this new love is going to happen very fast but it's going to kind of swoop you off your feet again just be mindful of your statement is right um Still keeping your routine, still keeping a calendar here, a planner here. Um, there's there's going to be no need to juggle that is what spirit is trying to say. You can completely let your, oops, sorry, you can completely let your guard down with this person, Cancers. Started by the Knight of Wands in reverse. The King of Pentacles, the Devil, and the Page of Pentacles. Strong, strong earth sign energy. Someone could be leaving a family behind or they're just kind of sticking towards financial matters there's no love involved here this could be a you just finally realizing like i can do this on my own i don't need your help this relationship is toxic we're staying together for our kids and i'm just done type energy this person definitely has player like energy at the moment um i can see why this new love is trying to come in over here because you have to let this um, unstableness go and is dealing with this current person that you could currently could be dealing with i feel like for the month of march this is finally going to be your time to be like you know what i'm, I'm done this is a lose-lose battle for me things aren't working out and i'm going to leave but a lot of you can't because of financial obligation or again children here you know where we're going to live with school are we going to go to things like that so um we have the moon card in reverse here so things are going to come to light i feel like you are going to get your stability that you want financially here um Cancers. For some of you, your person is leaving a family chaotic situation behind where they were staying for their children and they're going to take a financial hit, right? Because they're leaving this alimony child support here. This is a past love connection that they realized this other person was emotionally manipulative here. We have the Empress energy in reverse, right? Like using their feminine energy to manipulate and overpower a past connection. Yep. Which is why this tire moment is coming in. I feel like you, so for some of you cancers, you knew about this third party and shit hit the fan and you blocked this person. And it's like now they're trying to come back in a little bit here. But they're realizing that they're blocked. This could be why that tire moment is showing up as well. So what can my cancers focus on for the month of March? We have big happy changes are coming your way. Yeah, and it's all, like I said, once you decide here. Be assertive. Meditation brings answers and look for a sign here. So for saying angel numbers, if you see that, if you start seeing those, look those up here. Signs are going to come in from the universe. Follow your intuition because big happy changes are coming. You have to be assertive with yourself on what you want. Please meditate is all I'm going to say. Please meditate to get out your head so that you can make this choice, right? Because the seven of cups is in reverse. I feel like for the month of March, if you can kind of slowly get into meditation, if you can, definitely YouTube has a lot of playlists that can get your mind right. I would start there. Yeah, Taurus energy, high priestess in reverse. You're done. Ugh, shit just blew up. This tower is just blown up. It's just, just uh, keep it going. Real. Okay. <laughs> the shit hit the fan. Tower moment happened. This person's going to come in and tell you that they lost everything. They're going to try to speak to you about this. It's going to be like very lighthearted energy at first. Like, hey, what's up? And then they're, they're just going to just, just say like, I, I, I messed up. I want to work on this. 
here's what happened. This other situation has ended. It just needs some time to tell you for some of you here. When does this person, angel, oops, sorry. <laughs> I was saying angel answers here. It's not the right time. And within the next few months here, we have the next few weeks as well. So depending on this energy of this kind of anxiety of what this person is feeling on wanting to work on things, but this person is so damn nervous with the page of cups, they keep um, fumbling the bag, you know, trying to come forward. They're, 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 they're shook right now. So right now is not the right time. We have within the next few weeks and the next few months here. For some of them, again, children are involved. Finances, money are involved. They can't just leave a situation, which is why it's going to take a few months here for some of you. For others of you, this could have happened a few months ago, and it's like, you know what? I'm done. Like, this ending brings new beginnings. I'm going to fall in love with somebody else, and we're just going to keep it moving. Yeah, some of you are going to definitely come across a soulmate again once you rele release a toxic situation here. So it's, again, once you focus on yourself, your self-worth, once you take time to actually heal, look what appears. Look what appears. But you have to take time to do so, all right? For some of you. For some others of you, you already done it and you're, you're going to meet your person, right? So take it how it resonates right now. Clarify the page of cups in reverse because you're coming out of this, um, for some of you, um, emotional bind that you had, you know, where you're finally realizing, okay, I'm going to start tapping into my passion, my creativity creative and dealers and make your own self happy again and once you do that once you start to heal yourself there's a new love again trying to come in because new beginnings are happening for you what you're doing is you're going to raise your vibration this month cancers your new person could be aquarius or a leo here it could be that past person but they're going to try one more time to try to um, talk to you definitely watching you this could be this other woman is definitely watching you for some of you if you were and that third party situation I was talking about, the third party is still watching you angry at the success set that you have. And not only that, they're angry at the person for lying to them and kind of keeping them in the delusion of um, stress. Right. So that's why saying meditation brings answers because someone is definitely lurking on your energy here. You have to clear that out. I think you know who this person is. You guys had arguments before. That's what I'm getting. That's just a select, select few of you. Yeah. Yeah. It's not a sprint, it's a marathon, Cancers. You can have it all, but you have to realize what do you want, right? We have the Knight of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles equals that Ten of Pentacles, but you have to emotionally align yourself, you know, your cups up in a row before you can get this. We have the Nine of Cups and the Nine of Pentacles side by side. The number nines represents a completion, a shift, and a cycle here. But again, there's that seven of cups. It's all about what cup do you want? What cup do you want to fulfill? And until you do that, it's kind of going to be in like a um, like a confusion haze is what I'm getting for this month in love. Anything else in love for my cancers here? What is this haze? Huh? Yeah, you're confused on what to do in regards to kids here. Because you, some of you want to give this relationship a chance again for the sake of the kids. But it's like is you're going to keep being in this downward spiral type energy. And until you cut that out, that's just how it's going to be. The cycle is never going to close here. And that's just, that's just how energy is. Some people are stuck in relationships. Clarify the soulmate, you know, because you it's codependent type energy. You want this person because of money or keeping it safe for the kids, but it's damaging the kids. So you have to be mindful of that. We have deception here. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. Yeah. We also have a lot of passion. That could be what's keeping you guys together here. They're definitely not um, being up front. Yeah, the snake. Competition, enemy, clever, malicious. Look over your shoulder. There's another woman here that's... This could be a mother, father, or a child potentially sabotaging your relationship because they feel like they know that this person is your soulmate. So they're going to kind of do what they can can to sabotage that yeah five of cups and five of pentacles yeah change is coming once you stop feeling hurt and sad over a connection or situation that kind of had nothing to do with you it's own internal person's issues here and until you do that then love is going to kind of be on the back burner but again you can you can achieve it we have the lovers the soulmates 
card coming in is just you have to decide on what you want. Yeah, you definitely have new love coming. A new love, a recommitment to love is developing. Balance. Yeah, one person is giving too much in this relationship and it's becoming this devil energy. It's too obsessed. It's too toxic. It's too control controlling. Strictly sexual, this connection is passionate but not enduring. This could be that lustful energy with the devil as well. Not only they provide, they're good and bad. We have leap of faith. It's safe to make the move that you're considering, Cancers. It's safe. We have patience. Everything will unfold in divine timing here. So the key for this month is patience. You know, things are going to um, take a turn for the better here. Continue to follow your intuition, but don't. There's going to be up and down moments this month where you're going to kind of feel, again, this defeated energy, Cancers. But you can see victory. You have to believe, though. You have to believe that you can see victory, Spirit is saying. And once you do, you have to balance out and take the leap of faith. Spirit is saying it's safe to make the moves that you are considering. You have to end this huge burden that's, um, you know, weighing you down. All right, any advice for my cancers? Any advice and love for my cancers? We have when you pass from this world, you take nothing with you but your soul and the memories you have with those you love. And yeah, that's very um, deep and wow, This is, but this is what you need to hear. This is really what you need to hear. When you pass from this world, you take nothing with you. So stop holding things in emotionally here. We have sacred union. Even if you don't meditate, journaling, you know, getting outside, taking a walk, getting along with nature here. Look inside yourself. <laughs> Examine what is causing you to feel this way and surrender. At times, we must surrender to old before something new can enter our lives. Let it go and it will all work out. Everything will unfold in divine timing. But there's obstacles that you are facing that are blocking for a movement here. It's better to say and know that you are protected. I can keep going and lean on your support during this time. I feel like this is our messages for um, a few of you who are still here with me. You really need to hear this, all right? So look inside yourself and examine what is causing you to feel this way. I'm going to leave it there, Cancers, and have a wonderful week. Just saw 222 angel number. Look at that balance.